In this video we're gonna check if it is possible to install and use Gcam on OnePlus 15. So in order to check this, we can open the Play Store and then we can search for Gcamator, which is an app that can be used in order to check if uh, there is Gcam for your OnePlus 15. So we're gonna install the app, I'm gonna show you how to check that information and what you can do if there is actually no Gcam available for OnePlus 15 yet. So in this case, in this case, I mean, we should be able to find this information if the Gcam is available. If it's not, then we can tap on request Gcam and then of course we can wait for the Gcam to be provided. However, it is unknown when we can expect it and if ever we can expect it to be available in this app. So in this case, what I can do is we can switch to Gcams over here and we can search for other Gcam versions made by, well, made for actually OnePlus. And in this case, we can find a bunch of different, uh, bunch of different phones. Of course, we can see if uh, they are somewhat. Um, we can check if they are compatible with OnePlus 15. So in this case, it seems that the newest version that I can find is 9.3 Android 11. There is also 9.3 Android 12. So I think I'm gonna use that. I don't think I will be able to find newer versions. So essentially, if you want to give it a try as well. Uh, you should be able to, well, you should find the newest Gcam version that is available for one for other OnePlus devices with the latest Android option. So we're going to tap on start download. Of course, we can see some ads in the meantime, but then we should be able to close it and just download the, the file. So let's close the ad. There we go. And we can download the app using the Chrome browser. Now, of course, this is an unknown app. I mean, an app from unknown source. So you will have to grant the permission for the browser to be able to install um, this app. Let's go to downloads. And once it is downloaded, of course, we want to open the uh, the installer. We want to run it. Unsafe app block. So we can tap on uh, this more details option in order to install anyway. There we go. And let's open the app. Now, there is a very high chance that the app will not be working at all or there might be some bugs and glitches the app may crash as well let me actually pick up the phone and let's see if it's gonna work so it seems that the photo mode at least for now temporarily is working switching lenses also work there we go let's see if we have the portrait available and it seems that yes the app didn't crash yet, so that is a good sign. I'm going to take a photo. There we go. And it seems that it did work. We have captured a photo. Now, besides that, we're going to switch to the video mode and let's see if we can record a video. There we go. And it seems that, yes, we can actually record a video as well. So the app seems to be running quite well. So you can do that. You can download the same version as I did. And uh, yeah, thankfully no um, no crashes, anything like that using the app. This is of course the camera app that we want to use if you want to actually use the Gcam. And that is pretty much it. So you can give it a try and uh, it seems that the app might be running quite well on this phone. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe.